<laughs> I'm just kidding. That, that was actually one of our more popular episodes, and I'm glad that you've actually listened to it. I actually we enjoyed talking to Seth immensely. He was he such is, a pleasant yes. person to speak with. I, I he just a very calm demeanor, articulate, funny. Yeah. He had great stories, so we really enjoyed that yeah. conversation with him as well. Oh, I'm glad I that you, you like listen to it. I think it's important that um, that we have. Um, I think people like like yourself and and Seth, people of, of that kind of um, more inclusive ilk, can kind of spin that whole narrative that if you don't believe in God, then you are morally bankrupt or that you you don't have morals. I, I think that's a horrible um, stereotype mm-hmm. that gets put on. And anybody that listens listened to you tonight or that went back and listened to Seth, there's no way you can say that. And and be honest. I mean, there's no way you can say that and and genuinely be an honest person. It's just not going to happen. So um, I think what you're doing is beautiful, and I um, I just think it's wonderful. And this was on a level I, I knew it was going to be good, but um, this was just so much more because I think that you're always learning. I learn something new every day, and I probably learned uh, 20 different things in this past hour and a half conversation. <laughs> oh, I'm very flattered. Thank you. How lovely to, that you would say that. Thank you. Well, it's true. I mean, and I learned a lot too. Just really enjoying this rap. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> um, well, I know it's, I know it's late where you are and I hate to keep you up, but I'm so glad that you decided to stick it through and come on to these two cranky <laughs> fellows from the states <laughs> I'm not that cranky uh, just a little you are <laughs> when i haven't had my coffee oh yeah then yeah I'm cranky. <laughs> uh Stephanie, would you cranky be interested as- in in coming back on sometime and um going through some uh i of the questions that i had i'll have you know that i got to two of them oh. out of out of nineteen, I so would we love might have to have her back. I would love yeah. to be able to ask more questions and I don't know, probably have a better time for her though. I think it's like one o'clock in the morning for her probably now. Yeah, one thirty. So yeah. we do appreciate yeah. you spending your your evening with us or early morning as it is in your case. So no, Absolutely. I've loved it. I've loved it, and I've just preparing for the interview. I've been doing a lot of reading and researching as well. I'm currently writing my third book, and it's called um, "The Irreverent Reverend Rides Again." <laughs> yes, I'm right that down. we will definitely put all those links in the video description when the video is posted. Oh, we need to do uh, that so real quick, um, sure Stephanie. If you would, yeah, if you would um, go through and and tell people where they can find out more about your ministry, where they can find your books, and um, however else they can connect with whatever platforms that you have. I know you have a blog and, and social media, so kind of put that out there so people can find okay. you and we'll link to it as well. Okay, so the the book title again is The Misadventures of an Irreverent Reverend, A Spirited Guide for Rebels and Renegades, and that's on Amazon, Kindle, and paperback. And my website is timelesstransitions.net, www.timelesstransitions.net. My blog is similar to my Misadventures book. I talk about miracles and synchronicities and the way that – a thought becomes a reality. So that's that's what I'm interested in. And that's it's called Miracles, Miss Stories, and Metaphysical Musings. So the link is Miracles and Miss Stories at WordPress.com. And um, what else? Uh, that's it. Oh, Facebook. Re- I'm on my Facebook fan page is Reverend Stephanie Clark. Do you have a Twitter? I don't do Twitter. I don't tweet. No, no Twittering. She's not a tweeter. No. <laughs> I should say not yet. I haven't. Uh, I'm still a virgin with that stuff. So. <laughs> <laughs> oh, well said. <laughs> well, uh, well, Reverend, however Reverend it was, it was a absolute pleasure to um, have you in the Church of Non Sequitur because I feel like that's exactly where we went tonight. And I haven't been there in years. So congratulations. You did something that I didn't think would ever be done again. Uh-huh. Okay. How wonderful. Thank you for being so open. Yeah. Thank Absolutely. you, Stephanie. Thank you, guys. Good night. Good night. Good night. Goddess bless.